Beste luisteraars van Blues Moves Radio, we zitten hier backstage bij Moulin Blues. En er is hier zeg maar een backstage ruimte voor fotografen, artiesten en andere mensen die zich schijnbaar belangrijk voelen in de blues. En wat wij zojuist gezien hebben is aan een tafel, jawel, de eerste officiële oprichtingsvergadering van de totale alle mensen die de blues, de Dutch Blues Foundation ondersteunen. Ik zal dit even vertalen voor de luisteraars, Dutch is Nederlandse Blues Foundation. Naast me zit hier een van de medeoprichters en chairman, ik zal het even vertalen, dat is voorzitter, Karen. De laatste naam, ik uh, ben vergeten. Dat ben ik vergeten. Newman. Mijn naam is Karen Newman. Karen Newman. Maar die is in ieder geval van plan om de Dutch Blues Foundation op te richten. Dat betekent dat ze de blues in Nederland kan ondersteunen. How you want to do that? Well, just to give a little bit of a background, um, I'm an American, obviously, and when I first came over here, what I, was very obvious to me is that the amount of talent that exists in Holland is comparable with anywhere in the world, especially with America. And so the, the possibilities that musicians need, I don't think are coming through for them. And so one of the biggest goals of the foundation is to provide the Dutch, art, um, the Dutch artists with the opportunity to be out there and be out there uh, playing on international stages and also having some opportunities in America. We zal even vertalen. We hebben gewoon verdomd goede bluesgitaristen en dan moeten we eigenlijk iets voor organiseren dat die beter aan de bak kunnen komen en ook in het buitenland. That's right. <laughs> How are we going to do that? Well, we have uh, different programs. One of them, uh, some of the programs are general, which means that we support blues on the very basis level. We have a program called Blues in the Schools, it's which we go to children, and we're actually introducing them to the genre of blues music, giving them the chance to play blues with professional uh, musicians, and actually building the audience of the future. Um, the other things that we have is we will have a yearly uh, awards ceremony for the best blues musician, the best band, the best CD each year. Year, the, someone who has had outstanding performances over a course of a year, they will be recognized uh, with the yearly blues awards. Then we uh, take part in the uh, Dutch Blues Challenge, which will uh, select one band or one artist, and we will send them to the International Blues Challenge, which takes place in Memphis. And they will be given the opportunity to be in front of record companies, bookers, agents, and all kinds of different things, along with a lot of other uh, musicians. And the Dutch Blues Challenge, how do I, um, if I have a band, and whose ass I want to have to, oh, have to kiss to get over there in America. <laughs> well, you don't have to kiss anybody's ass. <laughs> But it's always nice. Um, <laughs> but the way that that will happen is we will have a yearly uh, contest and there will be a competition and from that competition there will be a selection made. And then from that selection there will be one or... Uh, blues X Factor. Sort of like that, yes. But without the, uh, without the Simon... Uh, yeah, without the poppy bit. Interest, yeah. It's not a it's not a battle of the bands, but we're just looking for outstanding talent that would do well in America and we'll send them over there. If after this tremendously beautiful pitch, I wanted to be a member of that blue society for uh, for uh, Holland. Which side do I have to go? Which door do I have to ring? <laughs> which horse I have to stand? I wanna be a member of the Blues Dutch Blues Foundation. You just have to go to www Dutch Blues Foundation .com. Ik zal even vertalen, www, dat is www. <laughs> Dutchbluesfoundation.com Puntje kom. Ja, puntje kom. En dan kan je alles vinden.